Hey there, this is Matthew at Caldwell Banker Elite, and this is a uh, instructional video for setting up our new VPN system. The Virtual Private Network System is a tool that we use to connect for uh, to our network system when you're outside of the office. It allows you access to the intranet where you can get tons of items and um, you get the uh, logos and some other graphics and resources and guides. But more importantly, it also helps you connect our Mixi phone and communication systems when you're at home or out of the office so you can uh, be plugged in, uh, make phone calls, have your instant message access and all those types of things. So um, we have set up a URL to make this a little bit easier. Uh, you'll go into www, I'm sorry, HTTP with no www, secure.ietherspeak.com forward slash CVE. So again, that's going to be HTTP backslash backslash no www secure dot ietherspeak.com forward slash CVE. When you go to that website, the uh, it's going to take just a second for the system to get there. And then once the site comes up, you'll see Elite Secure Meeting and VPN. And then there, we're going to type in as a username. Your the office administrators will set this up. The uh, the extension before in your email address before the at Caldwell Banker Elite. So in my case, in most of our cases, it's first initial last name, and then dash and then CVE. The first time you log in, your admin will give you a specific password. Um, when you log in using that code that they give you, the first screen that you should come up with should be one asking you for your code. And as you see here, the screen comes up and it says, what's your old code? So this will be whatever the admin set up for you as default. And then you can go ahead and change your password to whatever you'll remember uh, right there. We're going to hit change password. And you'll see that it'll come up with a screen um, <clears throat> that has said, okay, your password's been changed. Now we need you to log in. So we're going to log in with that same username again the email address without the at call banker elite dash CBE and then the password that you just set up and then we'll hit sign in here okay, and as you see here if I'm on Windows 7 so yours may look a little different but somewhere will be a pop up window that says this website wants to install the following add-on juniper setup client CAB from juniper networks incorporated what's the risk go ahead and hit install and this is going to install a small piece of software on your computer that will be used in the future to connect to the VPN. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and hit install when that screen comes up. And then while it's installing, you'll see this please wait screen, launching network connect, and it can take a couple seconds. However, whatever the speed of your internet is, is going to be how long it takes. So it could take a few seconds, just be patient. All right? and do you want to download and install and or execute software from the following server? It will give you that information, and we're going to say always. And then you'll see here that it's going to start to download that software for you. Alright, now once it's downloaded, <clears throat> this screen will change and show you uh, how to connect to Mixi to download it and our internal web pages. So this tells you that you're connect. We can go down here to the bottom and check. You're going to see this funny little icon here. This particular icon you're going to see, it's got green lights back and forth telling you're connected. This one is the Juniper Network Connection. This needs to be um, yellow. It shows you that you're connected. If for some reason you um, exit out of it and you need to connect and can't find it down here in this tray you can go over to start all programs Juniper networks and then the network connect again and it'll open up a window connecting to this this URL and it'll bring up a window where we can go ahead and sign in all right this one's already signed in but if it wasn't there would be your username and your login um, you can also go here and change certain preferences and and uh, establish meetings and things. So I've got a bunch of different tools here you can use. Mainly, I, mainly I think we're going to probably use just the connect. This will allow us to now go into 
whatever we need to get to on our uh, intranet or connect to Mixie and um, be able to communicate with the office better. So that's a quick tutorial on how we get connected. Again, if you ever, ever have a question, feel free to call Matt and um, our IT guy or Colby in marketing or myself and we'll be happy to walk you through it. But uh, it does everything pretty much automatically. It should be a real simple process for you. And if you forget your password, give your admin a call and they'll be happy to help you. Thanks so much. Have a great evening.